be used with 8.0 they're the same friggin thing just 8 is a little better but I still have 7 because I can't get 8 but um what we have here is just a uh, clip of me getting a triple and of me of yeah me getting a triple and that's it I'm gonna delete this here I don't know why that's in Me getting a triple and a clip of me getting a double. Now I'm gonna teach you guys how to do a cool transition effect. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna go into the transitions page and you go to barn door. Now what you do is you come to this one, horizontal out, no border. You just put it in between the clips there like that. Now if you wanna see this, you put the fade offset to however long you want this to take here. Um, there because this you have to overlap the clip like that where you want it to fade out so as you can see opens up like that and now some cool things that you can do with this is you can change the size of it which that's really not even that cool to be honest with you alright well anyway you can switch it to in instead so this clip will fade in I mean We'll close in, but I prefer out because it just looks friggin' weird. Alright, you can change it to horizontal so it splits through the middle, but I prefer vertical. You feather, you could feather it out, and you can change the color of that, the split there of the two lines that splits it open. I mean, this kind of looks cool here with this white effect. It kind of looks like it's getting like split open with like friggin' like. I don't know, dude, some like sick ass shit or something, dude. And uh, what I prefer to do is what you can do where this is coming like this is with the next clip here, you can uh, make this red right here. You can split that, and then I, what I like to do is come down here to. Uh, actually light rays because you can actually get a really cool red color out of the light rays look you come down here you have the light rays in here you see they're like that well you're going to turn the strength down and you're going to change the color to red so it's like a really dark red color like that it's kind of cool looking so now what's going to happen is it's going to bust open into a red like that as you can see uh, I don't know I kind of want that to be uh, a little bit more there because I'm going to show you guys how to do an even cooler effect here. So, as you can see, this is red here. I'm a, and now, what you can do is where this is coming, you, where, where you want the red to stop, you can you go back to transitions and you can actually. you go, I like doing either page peel or page roll, but uh, you put this here like that. I mean, I don't know, whichever one you think is the best. And you stretch that out like that. So now look at this effect. You got this coming like this. And then like that. So you, that opens up into that. And then it peels that off. Yeah, so that's pretty tight. You can do that shit. That's pretty cool. Alright, now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to... Oh, well. Now... Also, I'll show you guys how to do some stuff, some pretty basic stuff with the uh, with flat with flashes. Here, wait a minute. What the hell? All right, forget this. I'm not even gonna fix these clips because they're mad annoying. Well, I'm just gonna. I'm gonna show you guys some cool stuff with flash. I'm gonna put some new clips in here. Yes. Mm -mm -mm. Do, 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 do. My videos. Wait, mine. 
blindfires. Yes, that's what we want. Eight blindfires. All right. So we come here, pop the first kid. Boom. All right. So move on. And right where it's going to switch to the next clip, or where you want it to switch to the next clip. Um, so right there. I'm going to split that. Transitions, you're going to go to flash. I like hard flash, to be honest with you. And now what you can do is, if you, I like raising the flash thing here the uh, transition braid or whatever you want to call it and I like putting the vertical diffusion up I mean you can do the horizontal diffusion too as you can see like it's changing like that and it'll, it'll fade in vertically and you can also change the color of the transition I mean you could change it to red you could change it to blue you could change it to green green is easy to see that so look at and it fades in like that so that's pretty basic stuff um, I don't know, there's a couple more transition effects that you can do. I mean, to be honest with you, I think they look very cheesy, but uh, some people like it, so I'm going to show you guys anyway. I mean, I don't know. It doesn't exactly look like that cheesy, but I mean. So what I do is, instead of the flash, we're going to put the, uh, no, the blinds. Now you want to use the bigger blinds here. You go like that. They sp it splits like that, but that is not the effect that I was going to show you. You could take any picture that you want, and you just put it behind there. And as you can see, it is... Let me just make this smaller so it doesn't look gay like that. Like that. Like that. And like that. And, alright, so look at this. Um, I'll just... So, as you can see, boom, it switches. You can see the picture behind that. That's pretty cool. You can do that with pretty much anything in the background there. All right, so let me think of some other stuff. 